Builder Hall is dead. Long live Builder Crap. As I told you, if you we were talking, I mean, as soon as Eric Salgado sold Builder Hall in December 2021, well, I've been aware of this because Eric publicly said, I've sold it. So now it was, what, you sold it to who, why, for what? It was a surprise, big surprise. But the new owners, they didn't uh, speak, didn't communicate, at least for a whole month. So I searched, what, who is this buyer? And I discovered that it, it is uh, the data center, the company who has been renting data centers to build a role for a long time. So they had money, they had internet bandwidth, uh, computers, and they had money from other customers and all the money from build all was going to them, you know, to provide the computer, the, the internet bandwidth. So I said to myself, it can be a good thing. It can be a good thing if the owner of this data center has a vision for build all, that is to keep the good uh, or even improve the good affiliate program on two levels, you know, to keep it like this and to invest money. Because uh, Builder Hall, I don't know why exactly, maybe poor management, but was losing money and um, or not making it because, you know, it was inflation, rising costs for uh, for computers and, and internet, electricity, uh, things like this. So the price always was growing up and up for Builder Hall, which was not good. I like uh, honest pricing and a good affiliate program so we can promote it. So I said to myself, it, can, it could be a, a good thing if the new owner invests money in order to make it uh, better, the software, and maybe lower the prices of the plans, keep the affiliate program, maybe uh, uh, improve it in terms of uh, commissions and things like this. Invest in Builder Hall, spend the money and make it, you know, start again and become number one in the market. But I said to myself, also, it could be a bad thing because maybe they just buy this because they have customers who, who, to which they could sell it and may, or maybe they just buy failing companies and make them look better and then sell them for profit again. Maybe it's this kind of business. So I didn't know, but they didn't communicate for one month. And the first time the new CEO communicated in a webinar, it was bad news for affiliate. So I, I felt like at this moment, okay, it's done. Because the affiliate, if not for the affiliate, uh, what is Builder Hall? It's just another piece of, of uh, all-in-one platform that there are m several others, you know? And so it's, it's, not, it's nothing. But the, there was a community of Builder Hall. Users, of course, but historically, it's also affiliate. User and affiliate, because you could not be an affiliate without being a user of Builder Hall. It was, at, at first, it was a requirement. You, 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 you you had to be a customer. So after a while, there has been some stories and I won't go into um, too much details. But uh, anyway, and after this first uh, webinar, all the news about affiliate program, uh, all the news were bad, bad and bad and bad and bad, always, never something positive. Of course, all, every time it was announced like uh, something positive, but no, uh, from an affiliate point of view, no. So, uh, okay. It was finished for me, I knew. So I stayed a customer too long with them. And when I, I wanted to left, I, I first I said, okay, um, it seems that now uh, you don't have to be a customer to be uh, uh, an affiliate. So since I have commissions coming in, I want to know if I stop paying Builder Hall, uh, will I uh, be able to still get the, the commission with a new program, you know, very bad program, but will I be able to continue to have this? And they, they answered me, yes. You know, the customer support, yes, it's possible. So after a few months, I stopped um, my account, my uh, customer account. And then what happened is I saw that uh, the commission, the recurring commission I was getting stopped also. The new commissions, they stopped. So I asked them, I, I contacted again and I said, okay, uh, a few months ago, you said it was fine, but now the commission stopped coming in. So now my balance is uh, $80 uh, uh, commissions but there's no more coming in, you know? Uh, so, because uh, the, to be paid, uh, it was, uh, you should have $100, but no new commission were coming. So I said, uh, maybe there's a problem. And they told me, oh no, um, if you are not a customer of Builder Hall, you cannot get commissions. So they stop 
the commission. I say, what the fuck, you, you said uh, I could. Uh, and they say, uh, oh, it was a mistake, uh, sorry, uh, um, misunderstanding, uh, um, we answered this, but no, it's not possible. I said, okay, fuck it. Uh, I said, okay, so please pay me the, the 80 dollars, and uh, that, that's it, you know, I won't fight with, uh, with this. And they say, oh no, because uh, our rules is uh, you can be paid only after 100 dollars, and you have 80 dollars, so we cannot pay you. I say, come on, come on, pay me, I'm, I'm gone, I'm gone. So pay me what you owe me, and that's it. I say, no, we cannot make any exception to our rule. So they make some rules and they can make no exception. So I say, fuck you, Bulldog. You're full of liars, liars, you know, because they lied to me, and thieves, because they steal the, 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 the last commission. That I, because I didn't want to be a customer again, to promote it, uh, and to, to reach 100 and be paid, and fuck, fuck them, you know. And they're full of liars and thieves. And that's, that's the summary. My... My, but you can say that I am negative. I am. Uh, I don't give the benefit of the doubt to people or companies, and um, that's a negative attitude. But it's often the truth, you know. So, so, and I, I don't feel sad about it because I'm used to to, to be uh, wary of people and things. So many times I, I I suspect them, and I found out it's true. I was right to suspect them, and a few times uh, it's not the case. You know, I suspect them, but uh, in fact they were honest. Okay, fine. So what? I didn't lose anything by suspecting them. Uh, so, you know, so, so overall, I don't uh, lose anything by this uh, attitude, uh, negative attitude. But then when I see uh, big affiliates, you know, the top affiliate, James Neville Taylor was the top number one affiliate of Bitterall for years. So he is now in uh, October 2024. So less than, uh, uh, let's say, two years uh, after the, that's been bought. Now it feels like it's the end because they block his commission. And he was getting about uh, $10,000 every month because he had a lot of uh, customers. Of he made uh, he was number one uh, affiliate, and they stop it. They, they you know they are not good even with the number one. And there was another one, uh, a good affiliate, but especially a good community uh, sticker. You know, they, she, she stick and she teach. She uh, she was a former teacher, and uh, she teach a uh, builder. She made webinars. It's Shelly Turner. And Chief Turner also has gone because they fucked her also. And even a commission, she cannot be an affiliate anymore. She worked for Builderall, you know, officially employed by Builderall. And even she has been fucked. So he is getting fucked, number one. And you can see in the comments that there was another one that I knew back in the days. It, it was a good affiliate called uh, Chad Bartlett. You know, Chad Bartlett? Here, here. He's very, very good uh, affiliate marketer. And... Um, you see, you see, marketing director at Builderall, because at one point he, he was employed a short uh, while. Huh? He was employed even at Builderall to be the marketing director. He was very young, uh, and very good affiliate. So with you, man, there currently holding up twenty thousand of commission on my account. No way to get it back unless I make as many sales as I used to make. So, you know, so so they fucked even the big affiliate. So imagine me with my eighty dollars. What I ask? No, yeah. There are really uh, people that are, you, you have to, if you want to hate someone, don't hate Hitler because he's dead. Hate them, the, the, the new buyers, the CEO, you, know, the f you should, if you want to hate someone, you feel like hating, find out about the CEO of Builderall, the team, like, you know, the, with their faces when they make a webinar and talking, you know, like, last month they launched Builderall 7. You see the webinar, it was so lame. Uh, no new feature announcement, all about uh, pay us this price and this price. They still make price, pricing tables for Builderall, but who wants to touch, even with, with a stick? I don't want to touch Builderall. It's full of shit Builder crap. So they are talking about oh, pay, pay us this and this, and, and, and you get oh, promotion. The first month you pay us only $7. That's very good. No, it's not good because the next month you pay full price for this crap, and you are part of a company of liars and thieves. So no way. And even they made a line of code. It's for free. Uh, you put the line of code on your website. Doesn't have to be a Builderall website, huh? uh, a WordPress or anywhere. And you will have five tools from Builderall that you can use for free. But this is also a lie, a trap. You put this line of code. Soon after, they will talk to you about oh, pay us uh, if you want uh, this tool to to be to work huh? uh, better or more after our limit. So they are they are desperate and they are not good human beings 
you don't want to give them. You know what? I, I see them starving, but they will not starve huh? because they, they starve other people. They steal money. But if I see them starving, I, I will not even shit on them so they can eat my shit. I will just put my boost in their face. You know, that's why you can hate those people. They are really hateable. Um, I would say fuck Burger, Burger Crap. And I said already to him because James, he made, you know, he, in his text, if you want to read it, he was loyal to Burger Crap. I mean, loyal because of his story, if you can follow his story. He was very shy, he found the community of Builderall, and he grew in this community, thanks to the other people in Builderall. And, and also, he became a good affiliate, now he's not sh so shy anymore. And, I mean, his, his story, he has uh, some loyalty, but also because he was receiving money monthly, so he could not say bad things about Builderall. And he continued, and he, in his software that he made called RPM, Rapid Profit Machine, it was, he has always build all inside. But me, I don't want to have anything to do with build all. So even RPM, I don't want to promote it anymore. Because when I send people to RPM, they are shown uh, a build all. So they should use build all in order for RPM. I don't want that. You know, I, I want any other software but build all because especially build all, I have something against them. The others, maybe they are bad people also, but I have nothing, no history with the others. But I don't want build all. I don't want anything to do with, with it. So, RPM, I said, when are you going to, you know, remove it? Uh, he said, no, no, you know, because he was still paying, getting paid, not because of loyalty of the history of build all, because this is not build all anymore. There is no community anymore. They are full of liars and tips. It is not the build all that, uh, has helped him, you know, to to become a, a better person, better everything. It's not this builder. He has the same name, but it's not so. The loyalty is dead now. With the builder, it has died two years ago. Now it's called builder crap. So make the difference. And I I would remind him also. Fuck it. Remove it, builder. Now I, th I think now he's in the state of still having hope to be paid, but he has, you know, he's dead for for a lot of people and even for him now even if they keep him they give him the money he will be the only one promoting this crap and and me after a while now it's two years i think that the one who stay they're only staying because of the money and i understand i understand but it's not my case so uh, they don't give me money so i mean him he doesn't give me money so the fact that he's loyal to build because he's receiving money is good for him but not for me. I, I really don't want build all. So I'm, I'm ready to boycott any uh, thing or any people who are still talking good about this uh, builder crap. So RPM, I cannot, I cannot. Uh, it's not possible. That he should remove it from RPM and be done with it and maybe promote uh, builder all. I don't know, but uh, with ads or other things, but not in uh, RPM because. RPM is uh, something that uh, many people use and should promote. And I don't want to promote Builderall because I don't even have an affiliate ID for Builderall. So when I promote RPM, if people buy Builderall, I don't get money. So oh, come on, come on, it's not possible. Huh? So that's it for this video. Bye bye.